what's going on guys welcome back in this video we're going to be going over gta 5 online's weekly update for june 10th to june 17th so if you are looking for the best money making methods for this week and looking for the sales in this video we'll go over that and we'll take a look at this week's podium vehicle before we get any further i'm going to ask you guys please to smash that like button and consider subscribing and turning on that notification bell so to start off this week we have this week's podium vehicle which is the entity xf so the entity xf has been in the game for so long now and can be purchased from legendary motorsports for seven hundred and ninety five thousand dollars so this vehicle has been in the game pretty much since release and it has been been a popular pick for beginning players back in the day this used to be one of the faster vehicles in the game and was used for races all the time so i definitely recommend you go ahead and spin the wheel this week to try to win this podium vehicle unfortunately today i spun the wheel to try to win the entity xf and i did not i ended up winning rp which isn't too bad but if you have the wheel to spin in the casino available to you i definitely recommend you spin this wheel every day of the week so you have the opportunity to win this vehicle and that brings me to this week's sales if we head on over to legendary motorsports we'll see the 770 is on sale for four hundred and seventeen thousand dollars this is a pretty good sale you guys can obviously pick your colors just like every other vehicle but this sports car is actually pretty nice for the price and then we have the 811 which is kind of a classic it's been in the game for a little while now as well and it kind of it's really nice looking vehicle and has like a i think it's kind of like a hybrid type deal but it is an electric motor vehicle so that was pretty neat that they have that so it's a very very nice vehicle to have in the game if you don't already have it and then if you take a look at the sterling gt we have that on sale for 585 thousand dollars which is kind of cool it has like the wing type doors i thought that was pretty neat if you guys would like to pick up this little old-fashioned sports car and then if we head on over to warstock cash and carry we have the b11 strike force now i was skeptical about this vehicle at first but i did pick it up and it is very interesting the turrets on it are really good i highly recommend you guys pick this up if you have some extra cash laying around and then if we head on over to elats travel we have the volatis for 1.4 million dollars almost 1.5 million dollars and this vehicle is not necessary if you have a yacht because you'll have this vehicle accessible to you already but if you'd like to pick that up you guys can go ahead to add to your collection and you'll see here that the ceo offices are again on sale they aren't 60 percent off this week they're 50 percent off this week that means you guys can get the maze bank location for five hundred thousand dollars and then of course there's the maze bank tower if you guys want to really flex on your friends here but that's not all that is going on with the ceo office you guys can get the decor 50% off the personnel are actually free to switch this week and you can change your organization name for 100% free as well the gun locker and safe and accommodations will be on sale also so definitely take a look at getting these upgrades if you haven't already if again if you have extra cash lying around I do recommend you get the gun locker first and the safe is just kind of like a little flex everything else isn't really necessary but if you have the extra money laying around you can change your organization name for free and then the font is actually on sale as well so definitely something I would consider picking up for this week's update and then if we want to look at this week's prime gaming sales there is the 190z I thought that was pretty nice that they added this to this week's prime gaming sales at $180,000 if you'd like to sign up for prime gaming I'll leave a link to Amazon Prime in the link below and you guys can sign up for that for a 30-day free trial and then link your accounts also if you're with prime gaming you'll get the Grotti Bestia GTS so the GTS is on sale for one hundred and twenty two thousand dollars for prime gaming members very nice vehicle for the price and then the nimbus is on sale as well for seven hundred and sixty thousand dollars for prime gaming members you will only see these three sales if you are with prime gaming so make sure that if you want to get one of these vehicles on sale that you sign up for prime gaming in the link in the description box below and that brings us to this week's money making methods and if we go to our adversary modes by pressing start going to online then going to jobs then going to rockstar created you 
guys will eventually find the adversary modes here and extraction is three times the money so if you haven't played extraction before i never have and i've been playing this game since day of release so i definitely recommend you guys go ahead and try it out it's definitely unique to some of the missions i've ever played so pretty much you have this ceo in this scenario that has crashed in a plane that has survived somehow fortunately and you have landed in the wrong part of town and you have to avoid a hit squad there's a hit squad coming after you to take you out and then you have a squad of bodyguards that are on their way to pick you up so pretty much you have to hide in this yellow circle and then once your teammates find you or you get in a vehicle with your teammates the enemies will be able to finally actually see you on the mini map so you want to get in your bodyguards vehicle and hopefully get to the evac point where you'll be safe um, so you'll have one team that is the hit squad one team that is the bodyguards and one player that is the CEO my first round I was the CEO I found this pretty fun I definitely recommend you guys go ahead and try this I think the CEO is probably the most fun team to be on of course but if you're a bodyguard you have a high chance of winning I won't lie the hit squad has a very low chance of winning as long as your CEO isn't going to pretty much sabotage you it is very difficult to compete with the bodyguards due to the lack of artillery the hit squad has but you can see here I won my first round lost my second round and we ended up making around seventeen thousand dollars this didn't take too long these two rounds didn't take too long I think I might have spent six seven minutes in there so that's not too bad for having a little fun time and that will bring us to our next money making methods which is two times money on VIP work and you guys know how much every GTA 5 online youtuber loves VIP work but honestly guys I have to say it two times money on VIP work is actually a really good payout especially if you're a beginner I do recommend you guys go ahead and do this I know it's kind of cliche or whatever but definitely go ahead and try to take advantage of this two times money VIP work if you have friends that need help making money this is a really good way to kind of like get them started really quickly and then eventually you can run them through a heist or something like that but if you're just trying to like meet someone and help them make a couple grand this is a very very good way and these missions can be completed super super fast especially if you have good equipment I'm using my sparrow that I got with my Kasatka which isn't bad at all you can use a buzzard a mark to oppressor is probably the best buzzards really good the Hydra there's tons of vehicles that you guys can be using to complete these missions and right now you'll see I'm completing the headhunter mission where I have to take out four targets on the map so essentially you're gonna go around the map and take out these four targets and you can do these in invite only lobbies so that means you won't have other players griefing you as you you attempt to complete these missions which really reduces the stress for beginning players that are trying to save up for maybe the Kasatka or some crazy vehicle that they want to buy this is a very safe way to do so so I highly recommend you guys go ahead and take advantage of two times money on VIP work not only for yourself but for your friends so you guys can actually progress in the game without having to worry about being griefed or dealing with any enemy players I complete this whole mission in around two minutes it doesn't take me much longer than that it's like two minutes and a couple seconds so for pretty much two minutes of work I'll get rewarded around forty one thousand dollars in GTA 5 online so hopefully this will help you guys make some money this week another one that I really like to use to make money is ramped up because it's a really good one if you have a mark to oppressor and you're trying to help people make money and that will bring us to our next money making method which is kind of insane there is two times money on import export missions for vehicles so if you have vehicle cargo stocked up right now you can sell it for two times money I don't remember the last time export vehicles were two times money I genuinely cannot tell you it's been a couple months I believe it's been like a, like a long 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 time since I've seen vehicle import export missions as two times money so I think you guys should take advantage of this even if you guys have KO Perico if you've had the Kasatka for like a few months now you're probably a little bit dried out or like done with running those missions this is an opportunity for you guys to run something else and still be somewhat effective with making your money this used to be the number one money making method in my opinion other than crates and honestly it was probably my favorite money making method for years so definitely recommend you guys go back and try this out if you haven't already if you have a vehicle warehouse and you'd like to of course use it now would be a great time with it being two times money if you make mistakes and aren't used to using the vehicle import export business this is a good time to make mistakes because the chances of you losing money on this business is next to none so pretty much for these 
missions you have to go out collect the vehicles and then sell them if you like a detailed guide on how to run this business effectively because there is a right and wrong way to run this business trust me there's a really good way to run this business so you can make lots of money really quickly if you watch this video I'll link in the top right hand corner and in the description box below you guys will be pretty well on your way to running this business effectively and making as much money as possible pretty much you want to do the opposite of what I'm doing here in your cell missions make sure you follow of the waypoint it'll make your life a lot easier but the key is to not crash because you'll lose your money so if you crash you actually lose money so you have to go as fast as possible without losing money and the only negative part is that it has to be done in public lobbies so you do risk the chance of someone blowing you up but there's ways to avoid that so hopefully you guys take advantage of this money making method I really do love vehicle import export and you can see I made almost two hundred thousand dollars and honestly if I hadn't a crash I would have made two hundred thousand dollars that's around a hundred and eighty thousand dollars profit for two little missions and that will bring us to our last money making method which is Mount Grotto's time trial for this week and this time trial is actually quite difficult if you haven't done it before but it's not too difficult so if you have a baddie 801 fully upgraded definitely recommend you go guys go ahead and try this out so you have 46 seconds to complete this time trial you want to have your motorcycle halfway in halfway out of the circle and something to consider is be careful of the train the train can spawn up here but you're just going to want to follow the path that I'm taking as usual and wheelie as much as possible when you're on the dirt you want to be a little bit more cautious but you can see I take these jumps and I eventually turn off to the right by that tree and then try to get on the top spine of this uh, little hill here now not all players will do that I recommend you do that I like being at the top or like side peak of the hill I don't want to be in this little valley for too long I find that it slows you down but once you do end up in that valley because most players do you're going to want to wheelie up as much as possible don't stop wheeling just because you're going up a hill trust me keep wheeling and then follow this little path and go right into the time trial you'll see I beat the time trial in 45 seconds almost 46 seconds right on the dot and was rewarded a hundred thousand dollars so you guys can do this once this week and you'll be able to win the hundred thousand dollars if you beat the part-time so you do have to beat the part-time to get the one hundred thousand dollars and you can't use any crazy vehicles you have to use like a basic vehicle highly recommend the Batty 801 fully upgraded or the Sanchez fully upgraded would be a good option to complete this time trial so hopefully you guys take away some of the best sales of the week hopefully you guys will be able to pick up something for fairly cheap and as well found a money-making method for this week that would help you guys make some money and stack up some cash in that bank account so if you like the video please don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and as always Thanks for watching.